This week, it's all about getting fit for fellas as it's Men's Health Week. So we thought we'd get you some top tips to have your other half feeling and looking like a regular Brad Pitt in no time. And don't worry, these tips will work on you too. Yes, it's Men's Health Week, and we all could do with a little more exercise, so we met up with personal trainer Emmy to get some tips on how to get fit in under 30 minutes a day, starting with number one. I'm using the Wii here, which is fantastic. This is really taken off. I thought it'd just be a fad, but everybody seems to be still using these things. So what's, what's the advantage of these things? It's so many different advantages. One of the major advantages is if you don't want to go to the gym or you don't want to pay the membership for whatever reason, you can just do it at home, so you have no excuse. Okay. I hear this track, so it actually has a calendar that tells you when you should be working out, what you should be doing, and kind of... It's it fantastic. You can, you, you can monitor yourself. You can also do yoga. Okay, something everybody seems to be watching. You can play football on this as well, right? So it's something for the yes. guys. Too. So we have the World Cup at this moment in time, so, and there's also a soccer game on this. If you like to get exercise out of the way first thing in the morning, then Emmy has a way of doing just that in tip number two. By using your own body weight. Using your own body weight is a really, really fantastic way to get your heart rate up as well. So even first thing in the morning, you could do something like squats or push-ups in the morning. OK, it's all well and good talking the talk, but how do we walk the walk? If you have, the best way to, if you go, if you try to have your feet straight, yeah. OK? Ankles, knees, hips, try and get them all in line. And one thing I have to stress is make sure you keep your stomach really, really strong. Okay. OK, keep your core really, really strong. As you bend down, don't let your knee go over your toe. So let your bum go back, straight down, and, and straight back up. So have, have a go with me. Like, yeah, so you, so you got like your feet that. out. Yeah. yeah. So, just not, so pretend you're going to sit on a stool and sit right back and straight back up. Exactly. They don't, they don't understand a bit of Michael Jackson there. So that's your squat sorted, but what about the press-ups? Simple. Try and get wrist in line with your level. Yeah. Okay, if you want to start off, there's a couple of ways. Let's, let's go with level one. See if I'm on my knees and my toes. Right. Level one. Elbows straight out and push yourself straight back up. Next level, toes up. Same thing, straight down. So your chin is ahead of my, see my chin is ahead of my wrist all the time. Yeah. Back up. And then obviously full press-up. For tip number three, Emmy recommends one of his favourite activities, dancing. If you're going to go out on the weekends, why don't you get your back up off the wall, as they say, <laughs> and then you can have a bit of a dance with your friends. Um, if you're going to dance, like if you're out on a night out, you could be out like for what, two or three hours if you're in a nightclub. Exercising without realising, genius. On to our final tip, which is going for a walk with friends. But it's not just any old stroll. It's not, not your normal walk. It needs to, as I said, it's, as we've been saying, it's really, really important to get the heart rate up. So um, your body is kind of used to you and adapted to you walking at your normal pace. So once you speed it up a bit, you're putting a bit more pressure on the body because it's not used to it. So that'll be more beneficial towards you. So with all those tips, you'll be fit and healthy in no time. For more information on Men's Health Week, check out irishheart.ie. And for info on Emmy, log on to emmy-music.com.